All right, hey everybody. So, uh, I wanted to show you the uh, second update to this Call of Duty Minecraft that I'm working on. Uh, there's a lot to go over, so let's go right into it. Uh, first of all, the uh, Timeless and Classic Guns, they had like a big update and they added a bunch more stuff. Like, there's a bunch more guns and snipers and whatnot, and they added more camos to, uh, like more guns available to have camos and whatnot. So, I made an update to the, like, weapon selection. There's three more, uh, assault rifles. And then two more pistols. Uh, and also, there is no, uh, there's no, uh, like, paid kills SMG or pistol. Uh, all the, uh, special quote-unquote weapons, they have unique ammo, and they cost money. Or they cost kills, which is money, I guess you could say. See, they added a, a, a nail gun and this weird, like, futuristic weapon and whatnot. And all these have their own ammunition. So they'll eventually run out, so you have to buy more with kills if you want to use them. And uh, these snipers and that sniper all use the same ammunition. They're just pretty much different looking. Besides one has more ammo. But yeah, I thought that was cool and important. Um, uh, moving on. Let's move on to a little update to the loadouts. So the loadouts, uh, I have made my own. Uh, just for an example of if we ever tried this. Uh, now they have security codes, and you can put in the code you want. Uh, it'll let you in, which I'll just break in. Uh, they have your normal loads, and then you can put skins, which we'll get to that. And they have chest the story stuff, which you can also lock in case someone gets in. Also, another thing is, uh, I'm, I'm just gonna call these, like, trophies, I guess you could say. One of these mods has a bunch of, like, cool little trophy-looking things. I like this. So if you, like, if we ever do a championship in the future, like, the nether weapon could be, like, a first-place trophy to symbolize you. Well, that was a cool little idea, but that's not gonna happen for a long time if this ever happens and also i've added speed to the uh like the pressure plates so that you can traverse it faster which i think that was pretty cool you'll see that's like a common trope with uh, some of the future things and another thing that is in this hub is a practice for parkour uh it is kind of big like i've been if you're lagging a little bit that's all uh, right that's probably gonna happen inevitably because there's so much stuff here uh we added a new mod where you actually have parkour so if you can control, you can, uh, I'll get a block real quick, go. you can, see you can hop over objects, it lags a little, little bit, but oh well, that happens sometimes. And then you can also slide, you can dodge, pretty cool, just advanced movement, you know. Uh, there should be a parkour practice right through here, uh, and you can spectate it, and uh, you can see from up here, look how laggy this is, Jesus. Frames dropping. But yeah, you can see that like it's just like a jump little parkour practice, and there's little details and whatnot. Looks pretty neat. I wish I could show you more of it, but it lags so bad that I I pretty much can't. <laughs> We're gonna move on to the next segment, which is uh, I added quote unquote skins, which you gotta go through this to get to. So there are five levels of skins. There's uncommon, common, epic, legendary, and DLC. Uncommon, uh, there's, it's pretty simple. They're just simple standard skins, pretty much. And I haven't made a price yet, but I believe I'm gonna make it a hundred each. Uh, common, I'm, I think I'm gonna make them like 200 or 225, but they're just pretty much common. They don't look bad, but they, there's better skins out there, you know? We got all kinds of stuff from knights to suits. They're just these cool little skeletons and then maybe like a Viking armor. But yeah, that's, those are pretty simple. Maybe like 225, I don't know, as I've said. Next up is Epic. I believe these will be either 300 or 400, somewhere between there. I don't know what I'm going to do. I really don't. But these are just a little bit cooler than the, uh, the, the, un, uh, the common skins, in my opinion, sorry. And I think these look pretty cool, honestly. You know? Uh, the last one, or it's not really the last one, but the uh, this one is Legendary. I believe I'm going to make these, like, 450, maybe? Maybe 400, I don't know. But these are, like, pretty much the top tier skins you can get these have moving particles and stuff but you can't see it because it's on an armor stand which kind of stinks but take my word they look pretty cool and i i these are all really cool skins and whatnot and dlc i plan to make these 500 and we have three different uh like things of dlc we have chainsaw man uh hopefully y'all are don't like it's don't get spoiled by this like i did but dingy katana man Spear Hybrid, Barum, Whip Hybrid, and Longsword Devil. That is six. And then we have Mixed. Uh, we have, this is an assortment of random things. We have Gus, Scorpion from Mortal Kombat, Ghost from Call of Duty, Ghostface from the Scream movies. Uh, and these are Attack on Titan. 
we got the scouts, the military, and the garrison. And then there's like the futuristic one that he's in season 4. And then the uh, final one is Fallout. These are pretty crazy looking cosmetics uh, you can get. I don't really play Fallout or anything, but these look really cool. Especially that one looks really cool. And yeah, my personal favorite would probably have to be this Ranger one. Uh, also, none of these, like like the Fallout ones, for example, they give you like an effect. But to make it fair, we have a mod called Cosmetic Armor. And you can put it here and it shows it, but it doesn't give you any effect or anything. It doesn't change anything that's happening to you. So none of these are, it's all cosmetic, it's not paid on anything. I don't like that in games. But that's the skins. And the last thing, I'm going to show you it from the outside because you can see why this took me so long. The majority of this was <laughs> the goddamn uh, skins because so many command blocks to type and program and crap. And those blue ones are going to be the prices and stuff. It's, it's, it's a hassle, but I think it came out really well and I'm pretty happy about it. Another thing that the mod added was more ordinances. So originally we only had this grenade and a, and a flash grenade, but uh, I have... Taken from the mod, the smoke grenade and the duco grenade that they have added. But we have put those on the, uh, on all the, like, I, I added them to all the rosters. Down here, you can pick whichever one you want. Also, another cool thing is that, uh, all these are speed. So you can just speed through all these. If you really want to. Which I thought that was pretty cool. Slide. You can hear the slide sound. It's pretty cool. I don't know if I've shown these two new areas off. But these are the two, uh... Future ones. I don't have a name for them. Th this is gonna be like a water aquarium. This is gonna be like a Japanese garden. Or like a, it's not, maybe not a garden, but it's gonna be something that's similar like the, what I did in the old world. If I have a picture of that, I'll pull it up right now. Because it took me a long time, that was really cool. But something similar around there. And something else you may have noticed, which is I've also been working on, uh, all the way over here, is the team deathmatch mode. Or duel. Or it's not team deathmatch, it's duels, I'm sorry. The first one is done, the second one is not. This is lobby, it's gonna be like a lobby of a hotel. Uh, I have not finished that. I was gonna do that tonight, but it just slipped away and I started watching South Park, so yeah. Well, the factory is done. These are the, like, quote-unquote classes, I guess you can say. There's two AR, two SMG, an LMG, a shotgun, and a sniper. And there's one guy, a second team, and there's a spectate. So, we'll go to the spectate. This is what the map looks like, I'll go in the F1. Uh... I think it looks pretty cool. Uh, that's pretty much it. Uh, one person spawns there, another person spawns over here. And the person up here spectating comes up here, and I press start. And the things open up, and they basically just duel. They come out, do the little thing going around, and they shoot at each other. And first one that I wins. Simple as that. Honestly, that might be all. I, I can't even lie. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh... I, I've been pretty busy with school and whatnot, and also the uh, the scaring streamers and whatnot. That that took like three weeks off of my work. I was working in it on and off on this. Uh, I don't know if I sold this or, said this or not, but I plan to make a Discord soon, uh, depending on the reception I get from this video. And hopefully, you know, hopefully someone wants to try it. If not, it's fine. I don't really expect anyone to. But I do plan to eventually reach out to some people I met online, like on Twitch from Scaring Streamers, and maybe they want to help me out with their communities and whatnot. But again, I don't know what's going to happen or how far it's going to go. Also, I just want to say, I've been watching uh, this guy named Pirate Software. You've probably seen this guy. I believe his name's Thor. But he said something about how uh, just try anything and try your creative things and whatnot and just have fun. And he really, he genuinely inspired me to try and, like, try and show this off and show that I'm I have something here, you know, and I hope that you guys liked it, and I really hope that I can go somewhere with this, you know, because I've, I've been putting a lot of effort into this, as you can see in this whole channel. At this current time, oh, I just uploaded a video called Hidden in Plain Nesmith. Oh, let me just pull this up. We went from, uh, seven days ago, we had 607 subs, and we went up to 632. We had a thousand views on this video, that's crazy. That's, that's completely mind-boggling to me, but I, it, it's... These, on all these nice comments and everything, like, hope you do well, like, like, look at this guy, Dorian Blackbeck, man, you're, what the stuff is fun, algorithm is cracked, and, like, all these people from the Hill, Silent Hillbilly video, or Scaring Streamers video, it was great, it's making me happy seeing all this stuff, I, the comments are really nice, though, and I, I really appreciate them, it really helps me keep going, and it makes me, 
It makes me happy seeing it. If this video does well, I'm gonna make a Discord. I don't know what I'm gonna call it, in all honesty. But, hopefully y'all are seeing this and y'all enjoy it, and that I can move further with this. That's all I wanted to say. From the bottom of my heart, I appreciate everyone and everything. A any little support is just grateful to me. Uh, my my grandmother and family have been believing in me that I can go far with this, and just seeing that it's there's a chance is just making me smile. It really is. Uh, I don't know how to thank y'all enough, honestly. Eventually, if I get big, I hope I can do giveaways and stuff like Penguin Zero is doing. Enough of me going on a monologue. Uh, with that being said, I, I hope you guys have a great day. I really do, and I appreciate all of you. And hopefully I'll see you in the next video, okay? Bye, everybody.